Yeah. Side B and up B are both too favorable. Uh, air dodge, you have to have immaculate timing. And it will be Greninja versus the Cinderella. It's the matchup we expected, mm -hmm. and it will be incredibly interesting to see what these players do. I mean, if Goat goes down a game, they could also opt to bring out the Joker. It wouldn't surprise too much. Oh, they're going to Smashville interactions. Yeah, obviously. Oh, this is a bad check. No? We're neutral? Neutral. Neutral. We're playing. Yeah, Smashville, really interesting stage for both of these characters, to be honest. Obviously, Greninja can rush down Incineroar a bit more effectively on the stage, but Incineroar obviously is going to get bigger conversions, maybe kill earlier, and that's also like the close space. There we go, General Scabs is already fraying, recoveries really nicely. Doesn't quite, I think that was going to be a back air from the go, but again, they get another back air, they're already pressuring out really nicely, and they're catching General Scabs from the every, edge, time. every single time. Wow, nothing he can do. <laughs> Good catch. That's perfect, I think that's it. He tried pushing him with the water. Yeah, they went for everything there. However, not quite finding it. General Scales is now there. his turn to push the ledge. But Lego gets out with the Nairns up. Smash really nice conversion. Lego has a lot of percent on the Sinner already. And the Sinner obviously falls prey to a lot of kill confirms. Being as big and heavy as he is. Ooh. Punish? Oh my god. Ooh. I'm surprised he went for that. Okay. Yeah, perhaps Lego like, not properly intercepting. The air dodge trajectory, however, General Scales is still going to make it back. Gets That's it. it. Oh, there that we go. Really good reaction. Pops up by the first hit, up air into a full up air. Really nice from the go who gets the first stock. And Lucky Power, I think we're already seeing a semblance of what I was talking about. The go is basically camping. They're basically just going for whiff Camping on Smashville. And it's working. <laughs> they're just waiting every time for General Scales to come here, and they're getting the back air. They might get the Hydra Pump. They're still doing the edge. Edge Ooh. guard. Scales is trying something there, trying to end it early. Well, 100% maybe not early, but... Ooh, every side B General Scales is making is not quite working out. The goal is showing pressure wow. on stage, not quite finding anything. General Scales, really Episode. nice movement. Yeah. Poppy reacts, Poppy waits for the option and punishes it accordingly. Very nice General Scales. Measures his higher up and has managed to get revenge. 18? 27? No, not probably not as much as he wanted from that. Yeah, yeah. Revenge doesn't power up some throws that much. Down, down throw is one of them because those combo tools, you don't really want to put too much on those combo tools. However, General Scales, even without oh, all wow. that much initially, has evened up and actually passed the goat. Two or three interactions. Just strong hits, that's all you need. Nice pressure, and you have to wait for that neutral B. You can't press a button, otherwise you will get hit. General Scales will find you, and he had the correct speed. Didn't quite get the punish, but he's still continuing. Incineroar advantage is very scary. The goat could lose a stock at any moment right now. Boys, oh, he's clawing it back. The goat is clawing this back. Yeah. The goat is pressing really nice to get some really nice catches as well. And Lucky Power, how could General Scales get down right now? Because the goat Ooh. did not let him down. Not at all. Like every time General Scales try, tries to land, he just doesn't let him do it. That is it, and Sinon does not have that many good landing options, so the GOAT knows that and is abusing it well, but General Scales is also abusing his kill options and has the revenge. This is actually a burn that General Scales doesn't make much use of before, actually, as in the Sinon, and now he's trying to get way more liberty and it's really paying dividends. The revenge does run out because it takes too much percent, but there Whoa. we go, set up into 48. Bloody hell. That dash attack, a criminally underrated tool in Sinon's kit. Frame 8, I get seriously powered up by Revenge. And General Scales is using it really well, but so is the go with Greninja's kit right now. He's pressing General Scales really nicely. Catches Whoa. only again. Almost Tried a third right I think that's meant to be a dash attack. However, it's still working out so well for them. And Lucky Power, we're getting to the end of this game, and our cards is going to win. Oh my, Larry on Smashville, that is going to be it. I can't tell who's going to win. General Scales did. Sad, dude. <laughs> that's all oh. you need. Well, good bird. He waited all game to that use that exactly when he wanted. Yeah. Exactly. Perfect punish. 77. Deserved. It still has to work for that. I mean, to be fair, he actually did. He waited all game until he had the exact opportunity to kill with it. Perfect read, to be honest. Very nice play from Jonas Scales, who actually goes 1-0 up on the goat. This would be a pretty sizable upset. Ooh. And honestly, one that I considered might happen when looking at this bracket. I see it, especially with how practiced General Scales is at the Gen moment. General Scales is incredibly cracked, and obviously there's not that much Incineroar rep in the country. You don't yeah. have, really have anyone you can learn the matchup from. After a Smash, obviously, it's really rarely. There was Radley, but they pretty much only played online. Uh, and there's General Scales, to be honest, and that kind of covers Incineroar mains. Wow.
Here we are, big Pokemon stage, more well, room to run well, away. Well, well placed against the Romains. Though that's your best source of practice. And if your best source of practice is your current opponent, you're not going to have that practice typically. Yeah. How uh, the Goat just pick a really good stage, I'd say. I was going to say, yeah, the Goat's got this counter pick on... Like, this is the right thing to do. Because as soon as you interact with Incineroar, he can kill you at 50 yep. on Smashville. Maybe not on Kalos. No, Kalos, huge stage, of course. It gives Greninja so much time and space to run around. Also, the wall might be nice. Incineroar, yeah. loves, to uh, Incineroar loves to climb like those stunted ledges to sort of safely get back on. However, you don't get that access in Kalos. So, nice counter pick from the Goat. Already making good use of it. Reads a little bit early, and General Scales is going to avert that. And the Goat is at the ledge right now. <laughs> that will be cling. Ooh, the Goat found their space really nice to back onto the stage there. And it's now pressuring General Scales at the corner. Scales trying to swing out with a burn, trying to find something. But the Goat is kind of just waiting with the, with the fares, and it's really hard to get in for Incineroar due to his limited movement. Well, last... Oh, there we go. Well, I was going to say, last game, both of his kills were off the top. But now he's on Carlos. Those kinds of things aren't even going to work, even with forward air. Yeah. And look at these recovery makes up from the GOAT. These timing makes up is insane. General Scale trying to read something, but the GOAT just has so many ways to make the timing and finally gets that up air to get the first stop down. 170 you needed that to be. That was insane. That's it Carlos. so long. That's Carlos with a super heavy. Forward air just going to kill offside. Fair enough. Strong character. Yeah, strong character, strong move. Really nicely spaced from General Scales. He manages to get the f first stock right back. I and mean, we're even again. And this was the last game as well. The Goat never really managed to run away with it. So General Scales has always managed to call it back. Wow, the open, I'm surprised the open catch. It's so active. And so is that side B as well. General Scales is getting a lot of these correct reads now. Oh, you see that water cancel in there to get off the platform? That's that was delicious. That was so clean. The goal is moving fantastically right now. The general scales is still managing to hold on to the lead. Not quite letting the go in, not giving them any free neutral wins until then. We should go will convert into a lot of percent. Pressure really nicely right now. General scales fights its way out with a fair. There we go, some pressure from the go. Oh, off the platform. Oh my god, the percents are already even. Just after one interaction. The Goat did manage to read that General Scales went for a burn there, but didn't quite get the hit, but now it's still got General Scales in the air, pressing really nicely with the other yeah. top. And man, I can't believe General Scales managed to do that correctly, but can he get back to the ledge lucky power? This <gasps> train of pain from the Goat is not looking to stop anytime soon. Oh, nearly got him off ledge there, but anything will kill at this percent now. I think you could say that about the other character as well, though. Well, true. Incineroar definitely approaching a couple cents, especially with all that rage at 150. The Goat does have to look out for those F tilts, up airs, back airs. It's all it's got those kill confirms, he's got those kill moves, he can find it. There we go. The Forward goat. is going to take it off the side. Yeah, first one manages to find something really nice from the Goat. General Scales goes for You this cannot DI in on that down throw at that percent. It converts into that back air, into the up air, and it will kill them if the Goat makes the same mistake. What was nice. that? Was, was that, that was dash there? That's dash attack. Wow. Again, frame eight, huge trace with everything, kills so well. Amazing burn from Incineroar. Really nice air dodge as well from General Scales to get back to ledge really quickly there. Gets a forward throw. Interesting choice. Okay. Does an up for damage, just an up for like the positional with back throw, but it's still working out. He still managed to maintain neutral and he has been playing neutral incredibly well, so it makes sense he might want to reset it. Again, another ledge hang from the GOAT. But this time he managed to go off stage, punish it with Luffy. Interesting. Yeah, General Scales had absolutely real time to all of the matchup gimmicks that Lego is throwing at him. I mean, Lego has already had the small count for this game, and General Scales has already thought of counter measures. This is really good counter play so far, and honestly, really well played for General Scales oh in general, God. who has the GOAT at 98 off stage. Oh my god. Oh my god. What? We saw what did we just watch? Line. We saw the same timeline <laughs> where, where we thought that General Scales might dice that, but he managed to get back on. The GOAT is pressing. This could still be game three. Smash. General Scales has to get back. And manages to cover really cleanly. The goat is pressing the corner. General Scales is using all the patience he has, and he gets a fair off. We are in the corner. <gasps> Lucky power. This might be no the end. The goat really wants to take this to game three, but anyone can end this either way now. Back here, misses. Oh, B. General Scales is trying to pressure. Wow, what a mix up! Yes! Oh my goodness! Wow, what a play from General Scales! That was such a hot finish! Crazy Incineroar mix-ups!
Jude is so speechless right now. <laughs> that was so sick! <laughs>